What's up, guys? Chris with Chef Sports Cards here. We are doing the 2019 December Collectible Card Club unboxing. Uh, for those of you who, who subscribe to my channel or check out these videos, I basically do an unboxing for Collectible Card Club every month. Um, it's a product I've been getting for a year and a half close to two years now, I guess a year and a half. Um, I do the modern baseball, which is uh, 2001 and later. Uh, I get 10 packs. It's $33.95. Um, there have been a few price increases in the last year or so. Um, I, you know, look, it's like opening in any box, you know, you, you never know what you're going to get. I haven't had much luck lately in recent months with it, but it is a lot of fun to get. Yeah, you're paying $3.30. They're all hobby packs in there, you know, so you got some possibilities. Uh, $3.30 a hobby pack, not a bad deal, you know. Uh, I had just purchased a uh, one of those blowout Christmas party pack, holiday party pack things, whatever it was. I think I figured out they were about $6 a pack in there were all hobby packs. Now, don't get me wrong. There were some pretty good packs in there, too. I mean, there were some okay packs, but there were some very good ones. There was a sapphire. There was uh, some updates on it, you know, 18 updates on and so forth. So, um, you know, they might have cost a little more and, and been worth it. I didn't think that was a bad deal either. It was uh, 120 for that, and you got like 20, 25 packs in it. So, and it was fun. Um, this is fun. It comes every month. It goes out on the 4th of every month. Oh, they charge on the 4th. It basically ships then. Usually you get it in, you know, three, four, five days. There. It kind of depends. Like we hit a weekend this this uh, this month, so came in a little later. But you get it a couple days later. Uh, I think they're out of Texas. Yeah, they're from Dallas, Texas. Really good guys over there. Uh, they watched my videos. They sent me a t-shirt, which was very nice of them. Um, and, hey... I figure it this way. You either enjoy seeing the cards opening or maybe you're thinking about getting it and you want to see what is coming in it. Well, I'm going to open it anyway, so why not you guys see it? All right. So real quickly, uh, before we get into this, to let you know, we have another video that just went up. We are doing a giveaway this month of a, box, a mega box of Top Scrum Update. Uh, all you got to do is subscribe to the channel, uh, the YouTube channel at the end of the month or on January 1st, I'm going to take all the subscribers, put them into a big random, random it off, and uh, whoever comes in first is going to win a free box of Top Scrum Update. So if you're not subscribed to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. Tell your friends to subscribe if they want a chance to win a box. Um, I mean, it's not a hugely expensive box, but they're not easy to find. And uh, there's some, there are some massive hits in there. So uh, I'm sure we'll probably dig up a few other prizes too maybe for the second and third place person i'll see what i can come up with this month and uh we'll make it a lot of fun so uh if you're interested all you got to do is subscribe to the channel that's it none of the you know you get all these crazy giveaways that i've seen where it's like you know enter this join this tell three friends pass this line. no none of that just subscribe to the youtube channel that's it okay and we will give that away on the first of january so let's check out our collectible card club for this month and see what we got. Now, I got to be honest, and I mean, I'm probably thinking to myself, I feel like I'm due to hit something soon because I, I, like I said, I really haven't hit much lately um, in like the last four or five months, almost nothing. Um, and again, it's all luck of the draw, you know, that's what are you going to do? But um, I've never had a massive hit out of here. I've seen other people get them. Um, certainly, uh, I'm trying to think what the biggest tip I've gotten like a Bob Gibson auto. And I mean, that's certainly not a massive hit by any chance, you know, but you know, I feel like I'm due soon. So we'll see. All right. So they got these super cool boxes. Um, I love their boxes. I reuse them all the time. Um, and it always comes with a little, kind of insert thing here. Uh, December is here and we are bringing the holiday cheer. It's time for the holidays. So we're loading up your boxes and hoping to get all our members into the spirit. Good luck this month. Uh, pulling that special autograph patch or rookie card. Uh, we'll continue to deliver high quality packs to your door each and every month. We're excited to see what the new year will bring to the hobby. Thank you so much for being a great customer. We always love 
your excellent feedback, blah, 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 blah. So there you go. There's always something in here. Sometimes it talks about a company. Sometimes it talks about a sport, you know, whatever. But, you know, they always got something in there. So, and then we got our packs. Now, for those of you who maybe are or want to try something else, they also do football, basketball, and hockey, I believe. I'm not 100% sure on the hockey. Um... But I know they do, I'm, I'm positive they do football and basketball. So if you're into those, you know, you can do that too. I'm a baseball guy, so I get the baseball cards. So let's see what we got for this month. So we got a Allen and Ginter uh, 2019. And again, these are all hobby packs. Um, so always some uh, possibilities. 2015 uh, Elite Extra. Uh, 2019 Series 1, uh, 2019 Big League, 2018 Series 1, uh, 2018 Big League, uh, Cooperstown, I think this is, I always forget, I think this is 2014, I'm not 100% sure, I think it is, I'm pretty sure, uh, 2013 Select, this one I haven't seen before, this is a new one, okay, um, Donruss, which Donruss is this? Uh, da, 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 da. I'm sure the, the date's probably spitting right in my face. Uh, ba, 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 ba. It looks familiar, but I can't remember what year Donruss that is. So it's, I don't know. I'm not sure. <laughs> And then 2019 Heritage. Um, so my only complaint in recent months, and I'm going to say it again because they did it again, is putting packs in that are hobby packs. Don't get me wrong. And I've broken plenty of big league. There's some cool, really cool hits in here. But there's nothing guaranteed. Um, you know, when I've done breaks, we usually do like five box breaks. It's a quarter of a case because they come 20 boxes in a case and usually get maybe three autos out of five boxes. So, um, and look, big league is inexpensive. Okay. Um, I mean, they, they have to make money. I get it. And like I said, there's some real possibilities. I've pulled Tatis autos out of here. I've pulled Alonzo autos out of here. So certainly possibilities, but much more rare than many of the other cards. So that's kind of been my only real complaint in recent years. Um, this Donner's package is driving me crazy that I don't remember which year it is. So I'm going to try and see the back here and, uh, Trying to figure out. I don't open a lot of Donruss. So. And there is like no date on the back of this. I swear to God. Usually like you can see the date. You know. There's super small lettering in the back. 15. There it is. 2015. That's what I thought it was. So. 2015 Donruss. So our oldest pack I believe is the Select. Let me double check this Cooper's down too. I know I'm being a little anal about this, but he always. No, it's 13 Cooper's down. Okay. So 13. I thought it was 14. All right. So these are 15s and so on and so forth. So usually I start with the oldest and go to the newest. So let's start with Cooper Town. So I can tell you this Cooper Town's collection has been in a lot of the boxes since I've been getting it. Um, I want to say for at least the last six months, it's always been in there. Um, it might be longer than that. Uh, so this is kind of a regular you tend to see. Again, I haven't opened a ton of this. So I don't know what or how much, you know, there are for hits wise in here, but it's an interesting product. Uh, so it always has one of these discs in them. Uh, there's a Frank Chance, which I believe that's Frank Chance too. <laughs> Uh, Yogi Berra, um, Orlando Cepeda, I don't really know why that card's different or what it is, I guess it's just an insert, uh, Tony Lazari and Brooks Robinson, so that's it, I haven't ever pulled a hit out of those, so I, I really, like I said, I don't know exactly what they have, all right, uh, so 2013 Select, wow, 
I probably haven't opened this since 2013, so um, I'm trying to remember what the cards themselves. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the cards always kind of look like this. All right, so we got Justin Morneau, uh, Jose Bautista. Well, we got a Ken Griffey Jr. backwards, so if that's something, then that'll be really great, but let's see. <laughs> Uh, select, I don't, kills it says on top, but skills, I guess that's what, is there an S there? Oh yeah, there it is, hidden behind his hand there, skills. I guess it's some kind of um, refractor of some sort, it's not numbered, would have been nice if it was numbered or colored or something, but Ken Griffey Jr. skills from select, uh, what do we got here, Adam Wainwright, uh, Steven Strasberg and Albert Pujols on the back. So, I don't think anything too uh, great there. This is a cool looking card. I do not remember this one. It's definitely a little uh, thicker than the other ones. Um, yeah, like I said, it's just an insert, but cool insert. Something I haven't seen in a while. All right, moving on to a 2015. Yeah, let's do the Elite first. I don't, 2015 Elite, no idea what we would be looking for in here. Uh, Frank Thomas, Nolan Ryan. Uh, there's a Tanaka Gold Stars, Franco Rookie, and Castillo Rookie. All right, we are striking out thus far. All right, 15 Donruss. I just kind of feel like the law of averages has to work for you eventually with one of these. <laughs> you know? <laughs> All right. So it looks like. What do we got here? Okay. P. Rose. Uh, Junior Lake, who I don't even know if he's in the league anymore. And David Ortiz. Uh, Seth Smith. Uh, oh, maybe we got something here. Garrett Cole. This says signature series on it. I don't know if that means it's going to be an auto or not, but it's Anthony Rizzo. And it is. All right. Anthony Rizzo auto. Uh, not. I don't see a number on it anywhere, so I guess it's a base, but that, that will qualify as a nice hit. Anthony Rizzo auto there. And then we have a Jose Abreu here, which uh, grandstand looks like, not numbered or anything like that. And then on the back we have a Baez the Rookies, which is pretty cool. Um, career slugging percentage two three twenty four, so it's numbered seven of three twenty four. So a couple of uh, decent Cubs pickups in that one. Anthony Rizzo auto definitely in you know, decent little hit. So maybe we're on to something this month. You know, we've got a ways to go. Let's see if he'll fit in here. We can, we can show off Anthony Rizzo there a little bit. All right, moving on to 2018 Series 1. Uh, Longoria, Mariznik, Sinsu Chu, Steven Strasburg. There's a Devers rookie. Decent pickup there. Rookie cup card, Rafael Devers. All right. Uh, Sanchez, Garrett Cooper, Alex Bregman, World Series card. Uh, Cuthbert and Bautista. All right, so Rafael Divers rookie wasn't a bad pickup. All right, so now we're into our 2019. So, oh no, I'm sorry, we have the 2018 big league. I'm sorry. So let's do the 2018 big league. Now 
Now, like I said, I am not against big league. I don't I don't want people to think it. There actually are some really their checklist is actually really, really good. If you look at it, it's just like I said, you're not guaranteed anything. So uh, you know, makes them a little bit few and far between, but there's certainly, I mean, you can get Otani and Trout and all the rookies and everybody else in here. So, Hoppa. and everyone has a goal. Every pack has a gold parallel. It's really like a kid's thing. Why they came out with it like, to try and get kids into collecting. So, but again, you can get some nice hits out of it. All right. So 19 big league. Pujols, Berrios. You know, it's funny. Uh, Nineteen big league. I had a box, and I had I did I had done a break. I don't even remember what the break was, but the break was horrible. I mean, we got like nothing out of it. So I sent out packs of uh, big league that I had as kind of like you know a way to say sorry. That it was such a shitty break. And one of the guys I sent it to hit the one of one Jose Berrios auto out of it. <laughs> so Gallo. Uh, Castellanos, Joey Gallo, there's the gold, James McCann, Justin Turner, Conforto, Scooter Gannett, and Dietrich. So nothing out of there. All right, Heritage. I am not the best person when it comes to Heritage. I don't know all the parallels and stuff like that. So if it's not kind of standing out and smacking me in the face, I'm not, you know, really great at them, so... Uh, Biddle is a uh, Yoma Kata, Billy Hamilton, uh, pitching leaders, bunch of pitchers on there Nola, Freeland, Lester, Mikolas, and Scherzer. Baseball flashbacks Aaron checks off more benchmarks. I don't know what that means. Uh, David Palka. Sporting news thing, Erlin and Roberto Perez. So it doesn't look like anything special there. I know there's like, I don't know, you can get like bubble gum stains or I, Lord knows. I, I don't know. Some of it's so crazy, but all right. Uh, we got two packs left. Tops series one. We just did a break of this past weekend. We hit a really, really cool uh, relic auto. Of oh my god, who was it? Tom Glavin, I think it was. Was it Tom Glavin? I can't even remember now, but it was really cool. The pack was so heavy. <laughs> All right, Jesse Winker, Sinzatella, Aaron Judge, Jackie Bradley Jr., Santana, Low, uh, DeGrom, insert, tops now. Bringing in Merrifield, Reyes, Gordon, Perez, and Boyd. Nothing special there. All right, final pack, Allen and Ginter, 2019. I like Allen and Ginter. It's fun. Uh, hobby boxes, Allen and Ginter, come with three autos, I think. So I'm pretty sure they do. So maybe we got a shot. You never know. But let's find out. Uh, Reggie Jackson, Blackman. It's a Scherzer mini regular back. Rather, Fisk, one of these playing cards, Molitor and Carlton Fisk. So nothing special there. All right, so let's uh, you know let's take a look at what we got here. Um, not a ton of hits, but uh, obviously a decent auto, you know. Not going to squawk in an Anthony Rizzo auto. I don't even think I have one, to be honest with you. Uh, and really, the only other two cards that were, you know, worth pulling were the Devers rookie uh, cup card and the Baez, uh, the rookies numbered. So, not a bad month. Better than it has been lately. Obviously, it could be better with 10 packs. But, like I said, I'm not going to... You know, I'm certainly not going to balk at an Anthony Rizzo auto. It's a it's a nice auto and something to add to the collection. So, anyway, guys, again, uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it you know maybe made you decide whether or not you want to get this uh, for yourself. Uh, again, I was talking about earlier Topps Chrome update. Got a bunch of them sitting back there. Um, 
We are giving one away uh, at the end of the month. All you got to do is subscribe to the YouTube channel. So if you're watching this unboxing, hit the subscribe button and you'll be in the drawing. And we'll do it on uh, January 1st. Just let it run to the end of the month. It'll be easier that way. So please subscribe. Be a huge help to me. And I'd love to give this away. We'll probably find a few other prizes we can give away too. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the unboxing and have a great day. We'll talk to you.